Starting YouTube on a tight budget has always been very important to us because we, plain and simple, didn't know what the hell we were doing when we started out. In fact, we still don't know what we're doing sometimes. If you're looking for a hobby which produces passive income, creating YouTube content based on the things you're passionate about has worked out for a lot of people. This is episode 1 on our budget gear for anyone who wants to start out making videos with zero experience and this might also be a helpful guide for those who are already doing YouTube now and who are looking to add to their existing gear. Today we are talking about the inexpensive Prone Store teleprompter which I got from Shopee Philippines for 1,807 pesos which after using it for more than a year has been a steal with respect to how much time it has saved me and some of us on the team when it came to video editing afterwards. For me, I am first and foremost a writer before I ever was a lawyer and an entrepreneur. You might even have seen some of my works in Inquirer or Rappler. I therefore depend on scripts like this one to help guide me through the creative process and to help me save time. What I lack in experience due to no formal training with a camera, I try to make up for it with a video through a structured essay-like flow. You can see this all in my videos, especially my chair review videos. The benefit of using a teleprompter is that it saves time on me having to cut out all the failed takes during a roll. Let's talk about how we... What a lot of people are gifted when it comes to spontaneous shoots like Anton who rarely uses the teleprompter. But even for him, it takes a longer time to comb through the failed takes. If you don't do A roll, then you don't need the teleprompter and you can just read out your script while playing B roll on top of your audio. This is one I did early on, but the problem with that is that you create less of a personal connection with the audience and it forces you to place a lot more varied b-roll so that your audience doesn't get bored which takes up a lot of time let's talk about how we set up the teleprompter for shoots the first thing you need is an app on your smartphone there are free teleprompter apps for both ios and android if you're interested in a video about alternative teleprompter apps let us know in the comment section below after a year and a half however i ended up falling in love with the prompt smart pro app for both ios and android it has a reoccurring 250 peso monthly subscription which i don't love so much but you'll see in a bit why I totally love this app. Again, especially if you're just starting out, try out the free apps first. Justin Brown has a great teleprompter app video which I will link up above. After you finish your script, import it onto your phone, open it, and then press the play button. The text will be mirrored directly at your eyes but will appear correct when you look at it at the teleprompter. You can use the Prawn Store teleprompter with either a DSLR or a mirrorless camera and a regular cell phone camera as well. The setup is a little different for both. This is how to set it up if you'll be using a cell phone for recording the content. You'll need a stand for both the teleprompter and the phone camera. The stand for the phone will need to have a cell phone holder which attaches to the stand. I have linked my recommendations below and you probably may have already have something like this lying around. After you have attached the teleprompter and your cell phone camera holder, install both cell phones. After installing the phones, you need a black shirt to sit on top of the teleprompter. If you don't do this, this is what it ends up looking like. Ah, there you go. Notice that the, that fog thing is gone now. This isn't the most elegant solution, but it is cost effective because it effectively blocks out the light which disrupts your clear image. For the mirrorless and DSLR, Pronster comes with several lens adapters depending on what size of camera lens you are sporting. I think it pretty much carries for all lenses. After you found the one which matches your camera, you need to disassemble the teleprompter, place the camera through the hole, and then seal it in with the adapter. To be honest, it takes some getting used to, and up until now, it occasionally takes me a minute or two to get everything to fit properly. After the setup is done, it is as easy as turning on the camera, sitting down, pressing the play button on the phone, carrying the script, and boom, it's like you're a news anchor. It's really quite cool how the words never appear on the actual camera footage. This setup is also very portable. You can shoot anywhere with it, and if you have a partner, you can even have him or her handhold the teleprompter as he talks. So the Galaxy Watch 5 came out in August 2022, and to be honest, I don't really know if it's a big upgrade from the Galaxy Watch 4. The added benefit of the app I use, Prompt Smart Pro, is the app listens to my voice so that the script only moves as I read it. Didn't know what the hell we were doing when we started out. In fact, we still don't know what we are doing sometimes. If you're looking for a hobby which produces passive income, 
The other apps I used forced me to set the scrolling speed to be either very fast to the point I have to keep rewinding it or really slow to the point that people complain that they place the video on times two speed in order to get through my voice. It is very important to understand the pace at which your viewers are comfortable listening to you with. When in doubt, in my experience, faster is better. One drawback of PromptSmart Pro is that it only understands English. So if you're using Tagalog in your script, it is better to use the static scroller instead because it won't understand you as you're reading it. While the Prawn Store isn't the most elegant teleprompter, it sure is inexpensive for the time it saves. You can also check out this video of how to make your own teleprompter if you want to even be more budget friendly. I didn't get to talk about the microphones we use or the music stand, but this will follow in another future video. Let me know in the comment section below if you have any questions or if there is any other content you want us to focus on. I'll leave links to all the items in the video description. Paminsan may nagtatanong kung may kilala ba kaming computer shop na trusted yung hindi ka lolokohin. Actually meron. Kami. Full service PC store ang Hardware Sugar. Nagbabenta kami ng PC components. Nagbabenta rin kami ng fully assembled rigs. We clean computers. Kasama na rin yung excellent cable management namin and CPU cooler repasting sa cleaning. We also clean and repaste GPUs. Nasa Makati yung physical store namin and you can also buy from our site www.hwsugar.ph na 100% palaging up-to-date yung inventory dun. Kung in-stock yung item sa amin, available yun sa site. We also ship nationwide. Thanks for watching and maybe one of these days, magkita tayo sa shop.